what is up guys so as you saw in the beginning of the video um, I just had my first meal of the day which was one and a quarter cup egg whites one egg a full cup of oats and then half a cup of blueberries and then we also had a cup of black coffee as well just to kind of get things rolling in the body this morning um, I'm gonna post so for the full day eating today I'm gonna post up here in the corner like the calorie count, like it's just like on my fitness pal, it's just gonna be a little screenshot. So boom, right here. That's meal number one. Um, and I'll do that for every single meal that I have today. Um, but yeah, like I said, you guys just saw in the beginning. That's my first meal of the day. That's been my first meal of the day for the past couple weeks, like for my off season. It's pretty similar in prep, like contest prep. Um, just varies on like the amount of stuff I'm eating. But we're slowly starting to add food back into the equation to gain some more mass. Um, but yeah, I just had my first meal at 8.15. It's 8.30 right now. I've just been kind of chilling out for a minute. But yeah, guys. So full day of eating at the beginning of my off-season today. And I'll be doing, every time my diet changes, I'm going to do a new full day eating video for you guys. Um, just because I want to show you guys. Just because I want to show you guys when the diet changes, like what differences you guys are going to see. So anytime my diet changes at all, I will be doing a new full day of eating video, um, which the diet right now has been changing pretty much weekly. Um, my coach just wants to see like how my body responds to everything. Um, so like I said it's been changing usually every single Monday, Sunday, Monday. He'll send my plan Sunday and then he tells me to start the new diet on Monday. So we'll probably be having a new diet as of next Monday, um, which again, it's just going to be more food. So I'll be showing you guys the differences throughout my off season. And then hopefully once all this quarantine stuff is over, we'll be back in a contest prep for a show towards the end of this year. But my, like I said, you guys, the main goal right now is just to put on size, especially because I'll be competing in the men's division now. Um, I do turn 20 as of June 8th. So no more teen years for me, you guys. Um, so yeah, men's division, it's a whole different ball game. Guys are bigger, more conditioned, so I gotta keep up with them, especially with the size. I mean, I've got good size, it's just the muscle maturity too, which that just comes with time and comes with age, but I definitely know that this next show, we're gonna do some damage, break some hearts, it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be good. And you guys will be here for the ride. It's fun. It's great. I love it. I love what I do, you guys. And I want to take you guys on the journey with me. Um, also, if you're still here right now watching this part, leave a like down below because it helps me out a lot. And subscribe if you're not subscribed already because why wouldn't you? Also, I'm trying to grow out a mustache, but your boy doesn't grow facial hair easily. Anyways, you guys, I'm going to go get some stuff done, and so I'll see you at 10.15 for meal number two. So again, I'll put the little MyFitnessPal thing up here in the corner. This guy's our meal number two, our protein shake. So scoop of protein, scoop of creatine, and then cup of egg whites, cup of almond milk, and 35 grams of baby rice. Very tasty, very good protein shake. Um, it's like off the top of my head, I'm pretty sure it's like 465 calories, but like I said, be up in the corner. Um, Hey guys, it's 10.30 right now. I'm just getting some stuff done around the house. And then I might edit this video as I go today. Um, just so that when I get to the end of the video, then I only have to edit a little bit more. Um, I don't know. I haven't done that before. I usually just edit the whole video at once. I've never been an edit as I go kind of person. But today's just kind of a chill day. Um, I have chest and arms. Today is a workout. But like I said, it's not going to be in the video. Today's just going to be full day eating and showing what I eat. So I said, no workout footage today, but next video I'm thinking of doing a day in the life video, which that one's gonna be a little bit of a longer one. I like doing shorter vlogs, but that one's probably gonna be around 25 minutes, 30 minutes. Um, so stay tuned for that. 
So I'm going to drink this shake, and then I'll see you guys for meal number three. Meal number three, you guys. So, okay, so it is 12.41. I have my meal number three right here which is eight ounces of chicken, three ounces of broccoli, and then a cup and a half of rice. And what we're gonna put on it is some sugar-free barbecue sauce. You can see my dog in the background. Um, I use this stuff because the macros on it are absolutely amazing. You can see 10 calories, only two, two grams of carbs per two tablespoons, and I only do one tablespoon, so that's cut in half. But, this is my meal for you guys, and then I'll have one more meal before my workout today. And so, again, I will put the my fitness pal thing up here somewhere. Um, but yeah, you guys. So I'm gonna chow down on this. I don't have much going on today. Um, I was just doing some laundry earlier, and then I took a small. I was gonna take a nap. I'm gonna take a nap after this meal that recovery time. But, so yeah, I'm gonna eat this and then go take another nap and then after that probably get some work done. But you guys, my 10,000 calorie challenge video is at almost 400 views. That's a lot. Um, if you guys wanna see any other food challenges or calorie challenges, let me know in the comment section below because I posted a poll on Instagram and it's pretty high up there, like 90% of people wanna see more food challenges, which I'm cool doing them right now, especially in my off season, so and I have like a cheat meal. I can do like a, just a big fat calorie cheat meal. So like, say like a 5,000 calorie cheat meal. Do like a burger, fries, shake, wings, couple cookies. So yeah, I'm down to do any challenges you guys want to see or anything specific on the channel you guys wanna to see too, just let me know. Um, but like I said, I'm going to chat out on this amazing meal and I will see you guys for my pre-workout meal, meal number four all right guys so we got our pre-workout meal meal number four why is that focusing on my hair pre-workout meal meal number four we got six and a half ounces of lean ground beef 937 percent and then we have one ounce or one and a half ounces of chicken a cup and a half of rice and then eight asparagus beers i usually have eight ounces of ground beef but i was out I only had six and a half ounces, so I substituted in an extra ounce and a half of chicken for the other protein, so I wasn't missing out on any extra. And so, again, pop up the macros right here, a little screenshot of my fitness pal. Uh, yeah, you guys, I've just been hanging out. I've got my little buddy over there, Stevie, on my bed. She's chilling. But yeah, guys, quarantine's really starting to get fucking boring. Um, we're gonna eat this and then we got a nasty chest and arm workout which I'm gonna pop in the video it's not gonna be I'm not gonna like speed up my workouts anymore I'm gonna like I'm gonna keep the so I'm not gonna like speed up any of my sets anymore I'm gonna keep it at normal speed uh, I'm just not gonna show like all the reps and everything so you guys will see in the montage so I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna go smash my workout so I'll talk to you guys once I'm having my post workout shake. Enjoy the montage. Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through the air. The pain I felt is painful, all is said and done.
what you assume The story's over now, I must conclude I am conflicted, watching where I step still Hanging in the balance, not the life I want to live I want to take it all, standing tall Fear I'm way the person you Just finished up our chest and arm workout. That was brutal. Um, it felt really good. I am getting my incline. Well, I'm getting my incline and my normal bench press up to like the same strength level, just because I don't want like my incline to be stronger than my mid chest or vice versa. So I did the same exact repetition and weight for my incline and plyo flat bench. Um, First working set I did 185, second set I did 195, and then my third and fourth set I did 205 on a flat and incline. So all in all, it felt really good, but food-wise, meal number six, we got eight ounces of chicken breast, eight asparagus spears, six ounces of white potato, and then we have half of a medium avocado that I'm very excited for. Um, my meal number five, if you guys are wondering, it was just one scoop of protein post-workout, so I didn't feel the need to film it. Um, but I do a scoop of protein, and then I put glutamine and creatine in it. I do five grams each. So, yeah, I'm freaking burnt. I'm going to eat this food, chill out for a bit, go hang out with my buddy. I'll see you guys when I'm doing something interesting or fun. I'll see you in a little bit. We got our final meal of the day, our shake. All it says is a cup of egg whites, cup of almond milk, scoop of protein, scoop of glutamine, and scoop of creatine. So it's like my meal number two, which is my shake later or earlier today, except it does not have the baby rice in it. So that's the only difference is that it does not have the Gerber rice in it. So this one is only about 300 calories. Um, so very tasty, very good. And yeah, that is my final meal for today. Alrighty guys, so that is it for the full day of eating. I will put the calorie count up here for my last meal. We ended off at about 3,100 calories. It's still pretty low right now for my off season, but like I said, food's moving up each week. And on top of that, you guys, we're doing zero cardio right now. And I get two cheat meals a week. So zero cardio, two cheat meals a week and I'm sitting at 3,100 calories, and I'm still staying at like 8% body fat. That is pretty damn good in my opinion. Um, but like I said, food will be moving up soon, and then especially when the gyms do open back up, we're gonna be pushing food like there's no tomorrow. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I'll probably be past the 5,400 calorie mark that I was for last off season that I was at. Um, probably get close to that 6,000 calorie mark, which would be insane but anyways like i said you guys i hope you all enjoyed the video and i will see you in the next episode video whatever i'll see you guys in the next one <laughs>